With Greg Anthony and Hall of Famer Doris Burke, this is Kevin Harlan. And joining us on the sidelines, another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. We've got the San Antonio Spurs taking on the Boston Celtics. To the paint, Duncan. That falls nice feed that time for Mono Ginobili. And Duncan just superb when he gets in close to the basket. He has a number of moves to choose from. And Tatum with it. Guarded now by Duncan. Five to shoot. Stolen by Robinson. In transition, here comes San Antonio. Leonard looking over the floor. Pass to Ginobili. Inside. Robinson throws it down. Love the show of force there from Robinson. And when he's deep inside, it is clear for takeoff. Here's the screen. Here's Collins. Puts up a deep three. Robinson pulls it in. Duncan right side. A second chance effort. And that's two points on the layup. Duncan's got his second. Duncan's got eight. Building up a big early lead. They have taken charge of this game. And they've been doing it largely at the offensive end. If the defense does not adjust, this could be a blowout. Buries it from three-point range. Now Jason Tatum has become an extraordinary passer. This guy knows the attention he draws, just gets his teammates involved. To the middle. Here's Garnett. It's tipped. And so is Ginobili bringing it up now for San Antonio. Robinson, that's good. Love a big man who can pass. Great instincts. Duncan finds the open man there. To the inside. Robinson pulls it in. Here are the Spurs with the ball. They're on a 12 to 3 run. Ginobili outside. And finished off by Robinson. And what a way to start this game, dominating at both ends of the floor. And give them credit for approaching this game with the right energy and intensity. This team has attacked every chance they've gotten. Now, here's Tatum. No scoring in this one. Pocket six. Garnett. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact. And he'll go to the line for two. Shoots the ball as well as any big. Very versatile out on the floor. Garnett draws a lot of contact in Tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. Absolutely. A wide open look for Bird. Good, and it's Tatum picking up the assist. Bird's got a couple of threes now in the first for the Celtics. No good from Duncan. Boy, surprised he missed that. But he... Three minutes of action so far in the second quarter. Spurs working the ball around now. Leonard with the steal. Pass to Bowen. Now here's Duncan. Poked away. And again, San Antonio turns it over. Tatum. Ah, here comes Tatum. 
Tatum. And the dunk by Tatum. Uh, this guy is such a gifted offensive player. Jason Tatum, tough to handle off the dribble drive. It's his first trip to the line. And that one misses. Good on the second free throw. And when he's starting to come off the bench, Ginobili makes an impact. The, the title of player any team would love to have. Outside Tatum. And he caught that pass and full stride on his way to the big slam. Side. Five second differential between the shot clock and the game clock. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. How about the confidence from this young gun? Jason Tatum's length is tough to deal with inside, guys. That one misses. Spurs leading by four. Back to Ginobili. Terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. And I think they count on him for that. He is a tone setter, extremely unselfish. Back to Tatum. <laughs> Emphatic finish by Tatum. I love that Jason Tatum not settling for a jumper. He goes to the rim with authority. Pass to Duncan. Going inside. <laughs> Duncan throws it down. Fundamentals, guys, using the one-hand slam. Well, he makes the basics look pretty exceptional. Tatum on the wing. He's got 15. Here's Collins. He's covered by Lennon. They set the pick. Six to shoot. From the low block. Here's Tatum. Robinson pulls it in. To the inside, and Duncan throws it down on. Oh, great pass from Robinson, scanning the floor there and spotting the open teammate. Garnett left side, fires the three, and hits it from three-point range. Garnett's got five points now in the quarter. Well, he showed right there. This guy capable of making shots, especially if you leave him that wide open. And there's the whistle on the shot. Took the foul, shot misses. He'll be shooting two. Just relentless on the floor. Ginobili able to draw the contact. And he makes both free throws. And now, the first timeout called here for Boston. One of the top stories here, Tim Duncan getting it done today. Boy, he's really had their number. They need to make some kind of adjustment during this timeout. Seconds left to play in the third. Celtics trail by three. There's the pick. John Havlicek on the way. Back to Tatum. Tatum using his size. Now here's Joe. He's got six. With the drive. And the shot goes in. Ginobili's got eight points. Well, Ginobili, he's like a whirling dervish. But he's driving inside. Just... It's stolen. Kuzi with the bucket. Kuzi's got the first basket as we get going in the fourth for the Celtics. I tell you, Kuzi is, is pretty crafty down there on the block. Has that sense of how to score in traffic. A three from Leonard. Connects from three-point range. And the Spurs lead by four. Confident and composed on the three-point shot at a critical juncture. And there's the call on Ginobili. That's foul number two for him. 
Tatum. From deep three-point land. And the Celtics hit again from deep. Well, Jason Tatum with the answer from three. That's how you stop an opponent's momentum. Pass to Duncan. Outside for Robinson. Outside Leonard. Shot clock at six. Honor Ginobili on the wing. The Spurs need to get a shot off here. No good from Duncan. Fourth quarter still young, just over a minute play. Here's Kuzi. Pass to Tatum. And the foul call in Kawhi Leonard. It's his third foul of the game. it out to Ginobili. There's the try. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Gets the first, that brings them within five. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. And it's out of bounds. And they say it was last touched by Leonard. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. They're up by four. Twelve seconds left in the fourth quarter. and that makes it a three-point lead. Eight seconds left in the game. Pass to Leonard to tie it up. Can't get the three to fall. And he commits the intentional foul. 